Wednesday, February 2nd, I'm Mark Kelly with your news to go. Today, friends and family saying a final goodbye to local radio legend Tim Bird, better known as the Birdman. Tim Bird died last Thursday from complications with pneumonia. He was 68. Known as the Birdman on the South Florida airwaves for more than 20 years, his love for his career in radio going beyond the day to day shift. He dedicated much of his downtime to working with local charities as well. And today he'll be remembered for all of those things and more. Services are being held in Jupiter with visitation starting at noon over at Beacon Baptist Church and then the funeral is set for two in the afternoon today. Also happening today, the Palm Beach County School Board will be choosing the new name of the new elementary school being built there in Boca to relieve overcrowding in the schools. The three choices, Blue Lake Elementary, Lakeview Elementary and Lakeside Elementary. The school is sparking conversations from parents on both sides when it comes to this whole redistricting issue. The number of students that transfer would all depend on where they live in the community. The new school is slated to open its doors in August of this year, just a few months. And Pfizer has officially requested FDA emergency use authorization for its COVID vaccine for kids under five. Now that age group would be the youngest Americans eligible for a COVID shot. It would also be a two dose regimen and each shot would be lower than the adult size dose. Pfizer is also testing to see if three doses will be needed. And if that's approved, the shots could be given by the end of this month. Sandra. All right, thanks a lot, Mark. And uh, weather wise, we're looking really nice today. We're going to see almost spring like highs on this Groundhog Day in the mid 70s. That's average for this time of the year. And we're on target for that at 75 to 77 this afternoon with partly cloudy skies.